C1 has been removed uh, here. So C1 was sitting in, in here, and then that was removed uh, a little bit more uh, quickly than we would in the operating room. And then the next move that we're going to do here, and you can do this in your own specimen, so just uh, if we can zoom out. Where's Matt? Uh, OK. Well, in any case, what, what I've done is we've done a midline incision from just uh, below the Ennian uh, down uh, to the level of about C2. Uh, and then we've just separated the muscle uh, off laterally. Yeah, I just want to zoom out just to show the incision. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. Uh, yeah, that's fine. It was just really just to show the incision. So it's a, it's a midline incision from uh, just below the Ennian down to the level of C2. And then what we've do done here is remove the arch of C1. Uh, unfortunately, in this specimen, the dura has not really survived that uh, very well. Can we focus there? Can, we f Can you focus? I'm on trying, on yeah, I'm yeah, that's fine. I'm at its limit. Yeah, just pull it in. Focus higher up. There you go. Yeah, I'm going to focus on the bar. Put the bone in the middle. There, you go. there we go. Is that good? Yep. Sorry. Yep. And so now what we're going to do, let's focus on the bone. It's kind of focused up here on the skin. Uh, uh, it's still be at the limit. Yeah, that's, that's as much as The only way I could do is I could stand it Yeah, stand it in. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, that's better. So what we're going to do now, and you can do this in your own specimen, is we're just going to do a craniotomy where we remove some of this bone. Uh, and then we'll open the dura, and then we're going to pull uh, the tonsils laterally, and then hopefully we'll see uh, some of the brainstem. <coughs> so, which drill is this? How do you make this drill go? Okay. Is there a sucker or something? Yeah, thanks. It's gonna thin out this bone. You can you can uh, do it with a foot plate, or you can do it with a, a drill.
better punches than I have. Actually, work. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Oh. All right, what we got? <laughs> Okay. Now, now we've got the bone off. This is our Dura. Let's see. Nice Hear that Kiari? Yeah. That's the dural band of the occipital junction, cranial occipital junction. Nadra. So we could tack our Jura back. Uh, yeah, in the, in the interest of necessity, we'll just resect it. We're not going to have to patch, we're not going to have to close this case. We can open our arachnoid. Oh, there's pica, probably. All right. Well, you did tumor. Yeah, well, there's pica. What's left? It looks like yours. It looks like your head. Just turned it into a vascular case. So. But now it's a problem if you test. And it's uh, pretty it's mushy. Like total mush. Yeah, I don't think it's even worth getting these heads. Um, yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, that's there's Yeah, that's kind of soup. Soup to nuts. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not going to show too much, I don't think. Um, All right. That looks like that looks like four. These are tonsils coming down. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we probably need the injected. <laughs> I think that's that? That? aqueduct, maybe. That's there. It looks that's really like floor. Looks fibrotic. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think 
We've got uh, tonsil here with some floor here. The tonsil collapsing down. There's Piker on that side. And then on this side, here's the vela, the, uh, the, the tinea, sorry, right here. And then going up to aqueduct up there. Isn't but Right, no, we're definitely higher up. This is what's left of tonsil, I think, this mush. It's the, unfortunately, that's the first to go. But that's about as much as you can really see. Um, let's open up the, uh, the tila. There we go. Now at least you can kind of see up there, and that's, I think that's floor there, it's just very mushy. That's floor there. Cool. Awesome. Thank you, sir. <laughs> All right.